So, apparently a lion got shot. Lion. Right. I don't give a fucking shit. What was the lion's name? Cecil or something? Cecil the lion or something. Right. Right. It's a lion. Mm. It got shot. Mm. It did get shot by, it, it by a get, dentist. By a dentist. Which ain't bad. Yeah. I mean, it's rare that dentists kill anything. Except the dentist killer. Yeah. The famous dentist killer yeah. of 76. Unless they're killing plaque. Yeah. Or roots. Or roots. Yeah. I'd watch a dentist root someone. Have, it, have you seen, um, is it Terrible Bosses? Or I, I've seen awful, awful bosses. Or I know something. what you're talking about. I've seen the second half of that movie. Horrible, Horrible bosses. bosses. That's Horrible, it. Where Jennifer Aniston, the dentist, rapes someone in a dentist chair. Yeah. Even being raped by Jennifer Aniston, I still don't think I'd in, I'd enjoy the experience. What of being gassed? To no, I mean just being with Jennifer rape. Aniston. Oh, really? Yeah, she's all fucking jaw. She is all jaw. You know those people have got, like, something wrong with them, and you can only tell they've got something wrong with them because their fucking lower face is just extra large. Right, but if you've got the choice of being gassed out in a dentist chair by Jennifer Aniston... Yeah. ...or fucking roofied by Bill Cosby, which would you go for? I get the feeling Bill Cosby would look after you afterwards. He'd give you a bit of a snuggle. Reports are he only dipped in a few fingers. (laughs) He didn't go for the full sex. How many fingers? Like I, I don't want to be quoted on this, but I reckon like three, three. Eh, that's not bad. I, I, I was kind of hoping talking to the man who fists people. Yeah, I was hoping that he was a, a fellow fister, <laughs> not a fister of fellows, a fellow fister. When you fist people, yes. Do you like you personally? Yeah. Okay. When I do you start with a straight hand? I start with and run. close, or do you go? Straight in with a fist. Start with a run up. Right. And just keep pushing. If you meet resistance, yeah. they're not willing enough. So there's a degree of accuracy involved. Because if you like bounce it off a thigh, it's never No, nah, man. That's the really good thing about women. They're so fucking squidgy. If you hit the wrong spot, part. Yeah. Spa. Spa. Yeah. Most times, I'm going to say nine times out of ten, you will slide right in. Right. Just through friction alone. Okay, well, that's good to know for the future. Yeah. Um, anyway, get back to the lion. Yeah. This so the point of your own. Yeah. So some prick shot a lion, and the world is in uproar. <laughs> Proper uproar. Yeah. And you know who they're in uproar about? The guy who took the shot. Yeah. The dentist. Not the people that he paid to organise yeah. it. And he paid like, wasn't it like, Fif- ten, ten, fifty fi- grand, fifty grand, fifty thousand dollars, which is like seven thousand pounds. Seven thousand pounds. Right. Um. Yeah. We make the joke every time you mention dollars. But oh, even sorry. still, yeah, it, it's a significant amount of money yeah. to do that. Yeah. And what the story is, is that these trackers used food to yeah. entice a lion out of an area where it's illegal to shoot them. Yeah. Into private property. Right. Where it is illegal to shoot. Yeah. So the lion was in an area it shouldn't be. It was enticed out by food. Yes. Into an area it shouldn't be. They know it was enticed out by food. Yeah. Okay. Well, it, yeah. Okay. Because it was shot on private property. Yeah. If it had been in where it usually dicks around, yeah. you can't shoot them there. Yeah, and lions know, don't they? They yeah. know where they're shooting. Yeah, lions are. know the law of the land. They, they know the fucking law of the land. Yeah. Um, yeah, I feel a lion died. That's not a, a nice <laughs> thing. This guy, his life is fucked. He's had to close down his uh, dentistry. Yep, yeah, people were outside his, his residence yep. dressing up as fucking <laughs> Zimbabweans <laughs> or something. Yeah. Hunting lion. <laughs> How does a Zimbabwean dress? It was wearing like a hat made of flower. Right. Flowers, not not not, not like white. they weren't whiting up. <laughs> um cuz that'd be racist. Um but yeah. Yeah. Imagine that like if there was a a serial killer who took out hookers. Yeah. And they found out who it was, right? You wouldn't get people dressed outside the house as hookers in protest. No, you, you'd Because think, it's a lion. Yeah. They'd be like, fuck it, we'll dress up yeah. as Zimbabweans yeah. and hang outside the And everyone dentist. just goes, Zimba. <laughs> um, but you know it's a non issue yeah. when Ricky Gervais has to get his cunty face involved. Ricky Gervais has come out and. Really? Yeah, he's, he's, yeah. He's, he's very anti hunting. Remember the bird who shot the giraffe? Yeah, and how he vilified. That one I understood because, like, why would you shoot a giraffe and then take a picture of yourself next to the dead giraffe? Because it's a it. sport. But is it a sport? Well, it, to her it is. 
right? What if it was? If you took, right, if you took, if, you, if, you, if she thing? had taken out the giraffe like with a Bowie knife yeah. in a hand-to-hand conflict, then it's a sport. If it was, an, if it's just shooting something, that's just fucking. Right. What's his problem with the fact that it happened, or a white person done it? He's no, it's hunting. He doesn't like hunting. But how many people who are native to a country where it's yeah. happened has he kind of gone for? To his defence, he has gone on about local poachers who do the same thing, yeah. like African poachers who like fucking. Mm. Take has, it, has, he, has he ever Jared. fucked them up massively and shown pictures of Gemma- races? Uh, given I couldn't you know, say. Told, told, do the name. I couldn't say. Mass uh, if he has, it hasn't made the news in the way that this one's made exactly. the news. He, he's a fuck. Uh, he's a prick anyway. Yeah, he, he just wants a bit of attention. But uh, for me, the worst one was even Ricky Dre's. It was Peter. Peter the, Andre. The, the animal. Kind of, yeah, Peter Andre came out right. Yeah, and he was like. Don't shoot lions. Yeah. And everyone went, all right, well, you had sex with Jordan. And, you know, you, you stepped farther yeah. down syndrome. You know a thing about bestiality. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Jordan, what a mess. Yeah, and yeah. He's, he's fat, chubby, blind kid. Was it Frankie Boyle who made the joke about the kid? I don't know. That. Yeah, we, no. I, I, can't, I can't remember the joke exactly. And I, so there's no point repeating if I can't remember the joke, but mm. it was something about his kid. Yeah. Like... Uh, like the only reason Jordan was dating a UFC fighter was because uh, she could defend her from his kid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, but um, but yeah, Peter, the organisation, the, the mm. animal rights fucking organisation, have yeah. come out as a, at a full official statement to say that um, in response to the killing of Cecil the lion, mm. um, the US government should extradite the dentist to Zimbabwe so he can be. Uh, found guilty of illegal hunting and hung Hmm. so Peter have officially stated they want the dentist to be killed in retribution for shooting the light well that kind of makes sense because the amount of animals Peter kills every day Hmm. is phenomenal Hmm. so in the in a I found out today from the ghost yeah they would just want to murder pets yeah just fuck them just there's two alternatives it's either be a pet to a human or death they're the only two choices no, no. Yeah, yeah. No, no, yeah. no. It's just be an animal oh. and run free or die. All right. They're, they're just batshit insane. But people give them money and people like their statuses. But those people are also fucking stupid. <laughs> so yeah, I completely agree. You know, it's the same people that follow Ricky Gervais or, um, I don't know, who's that gay guy from Star Trek that everyone fucking George weeps Takai. over? That cunt. Yeah. Who all, recently all he does is just share BuzzFeed articles. Everything he does Sorry. is for attention, that guy. Oh, I hate people. But yeah, he killed a lion. He shot a lion. Yeah, it's a sport to him. Mm. Okay, well, let's question. Do you think it's a sport? Um, no, not really, I guess. But to him it is. In the same way that I don't find shooting guns and collecting guns exciting. But Okay, so... You know, How about this, right? He, he paid $50,000 for this yeah, trip, right? For an experience. For an experience, which was to, to track an animal, and entice it. it out, shoot it, and get his picture taken with it. I right? guess... Let, hold on, hold on. Here's my point, right? If, if, if it's the death of the animal that's the big kicking point, yeah. how about they do the same tours for the same money hmm. where you track an animal, entice it out, and hmm. shoot it, but instead of a bullet, you use a tranquilizing dart. Yeah. Knock the thing out, you get your picture with it, and at the end of the day, the thing just gets up and fucks off. Well, no. Would that, would you think that would be an acceptable compromise? No, because he wanted to decapitate it and then wear its skin. I don't think he took the skin back with him. Yeah, oh, I thought they did. I think, they I found think it after he fucked off, the local skinned it and fucked it off. But I don't think the dentist has got his skin. Oh, okay. So what's happening with the locals? Or are they just getting a free bus? Well, they get $50,000 out of it. Yeah. So the locals so would that are be right a- with it. No, the locals are the ones who've kicked off because it was like an iconic line. It was a line who represented that area of Zimbabwe. Right. And that's why everyone's so fucked off. Yeah. Um, they, were like, they had like a tracking band in a collar to see its movement. The way I see shit. it, and I'm going to... He's paid for an experience. Somewhere yeah. out there, someone was like, you give me money and I'll do this for you. Yeah. But that's what I'm saying. Would you, accept, sh- would you accept a compromise of not the thing unconscious? Take your photo, like, yeah, we call it. Not for 50 it, grand. Hunted. Not 50 grand. No, you don't 50 think, grand, I want to kill so 50, So it has to be death. Yeah. Dude, you could pay a hooker five grand and you could kill it. Yeah, but where's the sport in that? Hookers are easy prey. Not if They're give, already drugged up. If you give them a five mile head start, mate. They're already drugged up, bro. They ain't walking five miles. 
You can't fucking cowboy walk five miles. <laughs> <laughs> now I think if John Wayne is a hooker. <laughs> I'm sure there's a quote there that can be used. I'd fuck John Wayne for five grand. Yeah, I'd watch you for five grand. I think I think uh, watching's extra. I think a seven grand to fucking man watch it. Yeah, yeah. So we can we can chip up. We can, we yeah. can chip up. Is he alive still or is no, he dead? dead? No. Aww. Digging up a corpse is ten grand. T- t- but do you get to then lay with a corpse for yeah. ten grand or do you have to pay extra for that? No, ten grand is digging it up, fucking it while you watch. Okay. Yeah. I think yeah, that'd be right. So just so just so we know where we are, right? You've given the whole fifty grand, five grand, spend a night with a hooker. Yeah. No sex. So he could have got... No, 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 no sex. 20 hooks. You're allowed to lay with it. Right. And you're allowed to have a photo of yourself with the bird in bed. Right. But you're not allowed to touch her. That's Actually. It. Why not? Because that's what I'm saying. You can only kill her. No, 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 no. no. So you, you've spent you've got five grand to spend time with a hooker. Yeah. But you're not allowed to have sex with it. Right. Right. It's not much of a hooker, though, is it? But he spent... It's just a... Fr- you just, but he spent you just 50, a friend. But he spent 50 grand to hunt and kill an animal. Yeah. He did. He didn't fuck it. No. But you're saying, well, what if he spent the same amount of money and just didn't get to kill an animal? What I'm saying is, what if you spent five grand to sleep with a hooker, but you didn't... You spent five grand and didn't... Well, then that's what I'm saying. That depends on what, what the hunt is for. Is the hunt to kill it? Or is yeah. the hunt or is the hunt to hunt it? Yeah. Well, it's the whole experience. It's the experience of it's like experience. finding the tracks, using the guides, following the thing to where it is, luring it out into the open, and shooting it. Yeah. The only thing you're arguing against is whether or not the thing dies. Well, if that's part of the experience, if you are paying to do all of those things, yes. that's the experience. Well, is that, is that, then again, is that a sport? Well, you're paying for it. I no, is, that, no is, is killing something the sport or is hunting something? Well, is it the sport? a sport or a pastime? People say it's people say hunting's a sport, but. Well, the difference is, is that, like, in places like Canada, yeah, people hunt all the time. They hunt fucking moose, elk, yeah. like, whatever and, you, yeah, you know. And no one really seems to worry about that as much as when people go, because I, I mean, the other edition is it's an endangered animal. Yeah, like there, there was this, the, one of the statistics. Like, there's only two things about this story that did bother me. One thing is it they shot the fucking thing, yeah. the lion yeah. Cecil, and then forty hours later mm-hmm. went back to it yeah. and killed it. Yeah, because the thing was. Just, Fucked, you know, in a fucking bullet hole for it. So it just bleeding everywhere. It was a bone arrow. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. So it's got this fucking arrow in it for 40 hours. Yeah. And then they went and killed it. That to me seems cruel. And the other thing was, is someone gave out a statistic that said at the start of the century in Africa, yeah. there were 200,000 wild lions. Yeah. And now there's 30,000. Right. So over the course of 110 years, mm-hmm. the population's dropped by 170,000. And they're still being hunted at request from foreigners who come over and give money. Yeah. Which I think isn't cool, because eventually we're just going to fucking wipe them out. But that's tourism, isn't it? Well, yeah, no, fucking Disney World is tourism. 50 grand. That's a lot of money to a Zimbabwean. Think of how many hookers you could get for 50 right. grand. But 50 grand to a Zimbabwean. Yeah. What do they buy? Like, they, they eat fucking bug pâtés. If it's about, story, if it's about stories, right? Think think of the two comparisons. You can go back to your friends afterwards and go, I spent £50,000 to hunt and kill a lion yeah. in Zimbabwe. Yeah. Right? Or you could tell the same story to the same people and go, I spent $50,000 to get 10 high-class hookers for a night, rented out a hotel in Vegas, fucking doing loads of blow, drinking loads of fine champagne, swing off the rafters. Yeah. And I fucked ten amazing girls. Yeah. Which story would you prefer to hear? I don't know. I'd be impressed with either. So then just remove the one that doesn't involve the death of an animal. Why? Because none of the hook... Well, I guess... So you, you're saying because you I don't guess if you agree... Played the, if you paid the sex trafficker enough money, you could murder her. So you're you saying really because to. you don't agree with the scenario, he shouldn't have done it. I know. I, Even though I think, it is legal over there. I think if you're going to pay that money to a country that needs money, yeah. then do the hunt. I just think that you could tranquilise the thing instead of killing it. Mm. Oh, yeah, definitely. But he didn't want to. He paid money to kill it. I'm just saying that's yeah. the experience. You know. That is the experience. Right or wrong, he paid that money to someone who was willing to accept it, and for some reason he's the one that's being kind of vilified here, not the locals. Oh, yeah, I completely agree that the outrage... He's, I mean, this is worldwide. This isn't yeah. just like a couple of blogs on Tumblr going, oh, yeah. like, this is fucking yeah, his front life page is news. If he's but, got yeah. family, they're yeah. fucked. If he's got kids, they're fucked. His career's fucked. His career's fucked. He's, yeah, that's it. He's Everything fucked. about him is just ruined now. Yeah. 
In a few years, we'll be sitting back going, I should have kept it. that 50 grand. Yeah, yeah, I should have done hookers and blow. But <laughs> they've basically ruined a load of lives here without any care. You know, his family are fucked. There are people who are hoping to have fucking surgery on their, like, a teeth filling tomorrow, yeah. booked months in advance, can't fucking yeah. have it. They can't have ice cream tomorrow. Sorry, Mavis, Mavis. I thought you were getting your fucking, your tooth replaced. Yeah. Can't. Guy shot a lion. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And now I've got to sign up to somewhere else. Yeah. I don't know who else will take me. There's not a lot of local dentists. Apparently there's a Dr. Cosby down the road. <laughs> Dr. Cos. I, I think the world is fine to be outraged yeah. at the death of a lion, but I think the outrage is misplaced. I guess the whole argument comes down to one thing. Should he have shot the lion? Well... I know you say he paid the money, but yeah. the question is, is... Should someone... Should he have shot the lion? Yeah. So if it was another lion, they wouldn't care? I think they would care less. It's Because this one was like the iconic representative of that park of Zimbabwe. Yeah. Um, it was under a study. Yeah, it had like a trekking collar. Obviously not under a study yeah. enough for <laughs> someone not to care for four. I guess if someone look at the GPS going, where's that... Oh, it hasn't well, moved go, for six hours. I'm zooming in. <laughs> There's this weird thing sticking out of it. Yeah. I was like, it's, fu- it's the fucking weekend, bro. We'll look at it on Monday. Right. It, I, okay. Let's quickly segue into something else. There's nothing to do with lines, but similar on that thing. GPS. Yeah. Tracking. Yeah. Kids. Right. Recently, there was the anniversary of the fucking genocide in Bosnia. Right. right, I don't know about this. So yeah, there, yeah. Recently, there was, there was um, during the Bosnian Serb War, there was a, a village with like, remember uh, Slobodan Milosevic? Slobodan, Slobodan, Slobodan yeah. Milosevic. Yeah, Slobodan, yeah. Slobodan, that Slobodan thing he was involved in, where he fucking murdered like four thousand guys. Hey, he took, Slobodan. He took men of a certain age <laughs> off somewhere and shot them all. Oh, right? <laughs> oh, oh no, no. <laughs> I thought you only just took them. <laughs> he, he, it, they basically, the the, um, the the army in charge mm. s- slaughtered like 4,000 people. Yeah. And the argument was is that the US had a whole place under surveillance the entire time. Yeah. And it's not, it was like, you know, you're talking years and years ago, so it's not like you mm. had a camera on it, but they had refreshing camera shots from a satellite. Yeah. And they saw all these people arrive in this village they saw all these guys being shuffled off to farmland and fucking shit and they were like rows and rows of people and then the update would come like 90 seconds later and they're just fucking flat on the ground yeah and then 90 seconds later there's a new row of people 90 seconds later flat on the ground yeah. right they watched this fucking thing take place through the same GPS system they had on the fucking line which yeah. is you know watch it. they could watch what was going on and they didn't give up they just went well fuck it right we, we've got negotiations to do well, no, that's so. Okay. So, yeah, the thing is, right? Slobodan paid for an experience. <laughs> <laughs> Are you right there? <laughs> <laughs>